Hey, good morning, guys. <clears throat> it's Janelle. <laughs> so these guys have driven up from Kingston this morning. They're Digiview guys. So remember, Digiview is the security company that does all the security cameras and everything for us up at the Oasis. And between them and Lupo, hi, good morning. Um, we're going to be having our vet clinic. Remember, this clinic is going to be for street animals, for people who cannot afford um, regular vet clinics. It's basically going to be spaying and neutering. Um, and then we also want to be here to like take in emergencies. Sadly, the other day we were um, called out to a dog downtown Mo Bay and he was standing when the phone call was made to us, but when we got there, he'd already passed. We want to have a place to take these dogs where it's not going to cost a fortune, an arm and a leg. And that's what we're planning on doing right here. This is in Montego Bay. This is actually just up from Megamart. So we're probably going to be doing a lot of work, hopefully, with the Catherine Hall people. Um, they've done a, a, they've always been very good at calling us if there's an issue with an animal. So we know they're an animal caring community. Hey Liz, how you doing? You all right? Sorry. So this is our, this is going to be our new clinic. So yeah. We're going to be around the back. I think it's just the other, I think it's just the, no, she's done it. So this is, um, these are the gentlemen who are going to be, they've actually driven up from Kingston this morning. So God knows what time they left. And uh, this is going to be our clinic. Janelle is going to run through with them the whole thing as to how we want everything. Um, we're hopefully going to get subsidized. Um, it's a bit violent, that one, by the looks of things. <laughs> So Janelle, you tell them where you want everything. We have a bathroom in here. This is where the dog food is gonna be stored. Um, we're gonna be selling dog food for Lupo and Nutrim um, right here. So you'll be able to come and purchase it. And maybe if you're feeling a bit special, you can leave a donation towards getting a street animal spayed or neutered. This is all happening. Nobody argues with you now. And then that ceiling, that wall needs to come up to the ceiling. It needs to go right up to it because that is it's going to be the surgery room, so it has to be completely sterile and totally sealed. But just that place has to be kept really sterile. Let's have a look outside. Let me show you what we got out here. So out here, look, we've got purple flowers. Aren't they beautiful? So you know that's a good sign, right? Um, we're going to have a gate here and the fence is going to come along here. So this will be a, like our waiting room. I know it'll be outside, but you know, it's all good and fun. And then we'll have around here and then around at the front will be Digiview, which is the security company I was telling you about. Um, this is Catherine Hall. So this is where Digiview are going to be. Um, 
That's all right, darling, don't worry. I always do that as well. Every time I go on these live feeds, I listen to somebody, next thing I send a request a video, and I'm like, oh my God, I didn't mean to do that. So what do you think, guys? I mean, seriously, what do you reckon? This is gonna be huge. I just want everybody to have an option. Everybody be able to have their animals treated and it not being down to the fact that they haven't got loath as a man over there. Hi! <laughs> I thought that was a scarecrow. Fuck you now. Um, see purple flowers. There's our Janelle, she's on the mission now. She's very professional, isn't she? Oh, sexy car! So this is it. What do you reckon, guys? We're kind of thinking lime green and white. What do you reckon? I think it'd be nice and unnatural. Have a bit of artwork on the walls. Potted plants. Andrew has it, I think. Well, we all should have it. Okay, guys, so watch your space. Remember, please send us any ideas that you have. Anything that you think can make our little clinic because it's going to be our little clinic. This little clinic is, we have to find a way to make it self-sustainable and be able to help as many animals as can possibly be helped. All right, I don't want <laughs> That's what I thought, I love those colors. I think they're bright. And yes, the car is super sexy. It's my little Toyota sporty car. I got, unfortunately, I got a bit of a scratch. I tried to go in through my mate's gate the other day, Caroline and Steph, and the damn thing got me, bugger. Anyway, send us please any ideas you guys have, anything you think will be extra touches, anything you think we can maybe sell from here, anything you think we can do for fundraising. Remember, this is not, this is, this one, we have to make this self-sufficient. We have to make it, able to provide a service um, and not let anything suffer or anything go without help because they can't afford it all right or there isn't anybody there okay so let me know and check it out send pics send drawings send anything any ideas anything that you think will come in handy to help us because this is going to be the little clinic that has the little clinic that can I don't know I don't know I'm a bit bad with these things now it's just gonna be amazing it's gonna be available to all so street animal or not and remember spaying and neutering is the most important thing so this is gonna be like the front you'll drive up through there and then Oh my God, that's a great idea. Reach out to the local schools. We, the school, actually one of the schools, which was it? The Christian Academy did an amazing, amazing painting on our, um, on our cattery wall. That's a great idea. Fantastic idea. I think we should uh, definitely do that. I don't know, you've got to remember COVID and all that crap at the minute, so we've got to be careful. But um, this is it. Let me know. Ideas, thoughts, anything. We have to make this so that we can help all animals. It's not gonna be just people who can afford it. It's gonna be animals that don't have anybody and nowhere to go to. All right, that's what we need. All right, guys, I better go try and find this plan work out. And uh, I'll speak to you later. Thank you so much for joining me. Remember, send in those ideas, please. MobayAnimalHaven at gmail.com um, or on Instagram or Facebook, Twitter, what else? YouTube, LinkedIn, anything. Just give us, send us messages, ideas, anything. We have to make this. This is for the animals. All right. Take care. Lots of love to everybody. Bye.